Hi everyone, I'm so excited to be here today. This is Thursday. Um, so today we want to make sure that we understand art. Welcome to the world of art and we want to go ahead and get started today. Don't forget that you have to do your eye opener and I'm going to share my screen so you can see what you need to do on Schoology. Okay, so if you click on Schoology, you'll see the eye opener section under Thursday. You're going to click here for your eye opener. Once you click it, you're going to see your eye pull that you want to draw today. And you see your cast shadow here. Um, you see some highlights um, right in this section. You want to draw it and make it look clo as close to an apple as possible. So do the very best you can. Make sure you shade it. Don't just outline it. I don't want just a basic outline. I want you to actually shade it and take time and shade it. Okay? So just want you to see that and make sure that you understand that. Then you're going to click your assignment for the week and you're going to click here once you click there it's going to take you to this particular page and you're going to read pages 20 and 21 in the art textbook and you want to answer those questions that's on on that particular page so let's look at that I'm on this page this is page 20 okay we're going to look at Andy Warhol Andy Warhol was a popular artist in the 1960s I mean very popular and he went outside the norm and he did a hundred <laughs> this is his Campbell soup cans okay but what's interesting about this is that he actually loved to eat Campbell soup and it says he asked why did he choose Campbell soup cans for a subject he explained that he had Campbell soup every day for lunch for 20 years so that's why he has all these Campbell soup cans here and they all look the same. So I want you to actually see a better picture of Andy Warhol's Campbell soup cans. All right, so let's see if we can get a better view of it. But I want you to understand that even with these Campbell soup cans right here, that what's interesting about it is every soup can looks different. You see his black bean, split pea, vegetable soup. He loves some soup, didn't he? <laughs> um, we see chicken vegetable soup. So it's just interesting to see how his process, his thought process was. Cream of mushroom soup. So he was just, um, soup has a lot of sodium in it too, but I don't know. But I guess he really just loves soup. <laughs> All right, so that, um, it's just something I wanted you to see um, so you can get an idea of his artwork. And I just did a Google search um, right in for that. All right, so in your book, um, it talks about this particular piece of figure 118. You're going to answer the questions on page 21 right here. What do you see? We're going to follow these prompts here, and you're going to answer these questions and go from there, okay? Um, so answer these questions, um, and th that's for your grade. And I'm going to click here. You remember that the textbook is right here whenever you need it. Um, so that's basically um, information about Andy Warhol. And I'm going to stop sharing for a second. If you have a comments or questions, please put them here. Or you can talk to me um, or send me an email as well. So I'm going to stop sharing. And I want to... I have a video that I wanted to show but um, if you hear someone in the background like I said I have a little baby so she's she's not that little but she likes to talk while I do my videos <laughs> but uh, I just want you to kind of see let me see if I can get my YouTube to show but I am going to leave you all a YouTube video to watch about understanding um, Andy Warhol and it's a video right here that I'll make sure I give you all the link for. But I want you to watch this video and it gives you a little bit more information about Andy Warhol and what he did um, during his time period. You can kind of see some of his artwork as well. Okay. All right. Now let's go back here. Okay. So um, one of the things that I want you to do is make sure that you hit the submission button. Remember that you want to do your work every day. Um, when it's due so that way you can receive credit for that particular day. So it's just like attendance. So make sure that you do that. Recapping about the course, just so don't forget that this is your welcome video. You have your course and syllabus and information here. Also included office hours so you know when they are 
and information about um, what you need in your supply list as well. So those, that's just a recap um, to make sure that you know what to do um, and how to log on Schoology. So I'm just really, like I said, very excited to have you guys. Uh, I don't know if you all can see my screen or not, but um, just wanted to make sure that you all um, are able to want to make sure that you all are able to um, be able to see my screen. I think I'm going to have to try it one more time, but I just want to make sure that you can see the screen. Like I said, you'll see your welcome here, your assignments, your course here. And um, I don't know if you had saw my screen previously, um, but this is the section that you're going to answer for today. Okay. And I will include a video. I don't know if you saw that either. I want to make sure um, here, I will include that video for you to watch today as well. And this is your eye opener for today. Um, if you have any questions, please let me know. I'm here, um, office hours from two to three. Thank you so much for your time. And I'm going to stop sharing here. And I hope you all have a blessed and wonderful day. Thank you.